Hi, it's Andy here at Martin Atkinson Specialist Vans. We have had a lovely early T6.1 transporter come in part exchange. I'm going to take you around the vehicle now. It's quite a rare one to start off with. So it's the 150 horsepower DSG long wheelbase in starlight blue. It's got a really nice factory spec on it and the previous owner has spent in excess of £10,000 on additional enhancements. So it really is quite a special one, this one. Let's start at the front. As you can see, it's got the LED lights. Quite an expensive option. Make a huge difference in terms of your vision at night. Now, this is a 2020 plate, so done 41,000 miles. As you'd expect, a few chips on the front, which we've touched in. A few chips on the bonnet. It's worth mentioning this isn't a new vehicle, guys, so do expect a few little chips and the odd mark around it as it has been used. But as you'll see from us going round, it really is in superb order. No dents down the side there. And this has been fitted with the Devonport factory alloys. All the tyres were replaced in December, just gone. And it is the Falcon Euro winter tyres on there. So super tyres, regardless of the terrain. This has also got Bilstein lowering suspension. That was fitted by Wessex fans to the vehicle. And privacy glass there to the rear. As you can see, it's got the roof rails with five crossbars as well. So it's all ready for the outdoor life, whether you want to attach windsurfing boards, kayaks, paddle boards, it's all possible with those crossbars up there. Two individual captain seats in the front. Now being a Highline model, this one comes with Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, which allows you to use Google Maps on the screen. Parking sensors front and rear are standard and adaptive cruise control. Now this one in addition has the heated front seats there. It's got a fully electric tailgate and twin sliding doors with power latching. So if it's not fully closed, it'll just kind of suck the door in. We've also got a passenger swivel seat base here. It's a Sportscraft one, probably the best there is out there. So that passenger seat will swivel round. And in the rear is where the money's really been spent. So we have a full width rib bed here. Now I photoed it in position, sorry, I'm videoing it in position as a seat, but on my photos, I will have photos of that bed fully extended so that you can see its capability. It's also got fitted here bracketry for having a table which is just tucked away in the back there. And it's on a surface mounted rail system, which allows you to move that seat backwards and forwards, giving you really, really flexible space in the rear. It's had the proper cassette window blinds put in as well. They really do make it dark in there. Just show you over to the tailgate. And it's the same in this sliding door. We've got them too. Fully sound deadened and insulated. And this one does also have a Basto night heater, leisure battery and a charging point there. So the Webasto night heater control, just up here. You can set the temperature you want, make it nice and toasty in here. Again, quite an expensive thing to put in. So if you're looking for a day van that can be used as a daily driver for five people as well, this is a very good option. Yeah, we'll just go over the panels as we're walking down. Anything that stands out, I will point out to you. Move around to the back, it's got the tailgate. And there's also a tow bar on there too. Carbon fibre rear bumper protector, stop any scuffs as you're putting stuff in. And it is a fully electric tailgate as mentioned, so just a click of the handle there. 
and up it goes. Moving into the rear, you see the rest of the floor there. Again, we have got further 12 volt point and some kicker rear speakers installed too. This is your screwing table bit here. I'll show that up later in the photos. And that bit also comes down as part of the bed fixing. In here is your table arm and your jack and tools. So everything present and correct. Oh, you may have noticed also, we've got six LEDs in the ceiling. So we've got a little switch here, which turns four of those off and another switch at the front that operates the front too. Electric tailgate works off the press of a button. As you can see, tailgate, or the superb order. As is the bumper there. Got a couple of little touch-ins just on the corner. And a little touch-in just on the edge of the arch there. Looking down the lines again, damp free. And paintwork really in good order down here. Little touched in mark on the mirror. And two small repaired chips on the screen here from what I remember. One just there, one just there. We wouldn't replace the screen for that as they're only small and been repaired. This one's got the power folding mirrors. And mileage, as we speak, is 41,463 miles. Now, there's a full service history with this vehicle. It's just had a major service and the DSG oil changed. So fully up to date with its maintenance. It's worth noting as well, in December, this had new tyres all round and new brakes all round. So when you're looking at a vehicle three or four years old like this one and comparing, just bear in mind if it hasn't had those things, so we're talking DSG service, tyres, brakes, if it needs all those things, you could potentially be spending another 1,500 to 2,000 pounds on top. So it's always worth comparing as used vehicles are not like for like. So that's pretty much it in terms of the vehicle itself. You can see where all the money's been spent on it. And if you're looking for a multi-purpose day van and daily driver, it doesn't really get much better. Now we've got 20 plus photos on our website at martinatkinsoncars.co.uk. We've also got a full written description of the vehicle on there. We do take part exchanges and we can provide finance facilities. So if you're interested in the vehicle, please do get in touch and we'd love to have a chat with you about it. Thanks for watching.